Okay, hello again. So now we have painted the first wall, the second wall, and now it's time for the third wall. And Clemens is super nice and lets me paint it myself because I love to paint and he doesn't like it as much as I do. So I get to do it. And what we're gonna do now is we're gonna paint the kitchen wall and we are gonna paint on the same Palladio color. But we're gonna do it in a different way, and uh, yeah, it's stucco, which means you have much less water. So it's a thicker paste, and you put it up with a little spatula, which I forgot. Can I get it? With this guy. Yeah, so let's see how it looks. Okay, I'm gonna brush. Okay, so we're gonna do a 0.8 liters with one kilo. So we're gonna do a 0.8 liters with one kilo, then it's much thicker. Okay, I have to have a mask because it is very dusty. <laughs> it's like cooking. It is very thick. Once again, we're gonna do it. Uh, let's see. This is one layer, and it has to dry for much, much longer. I will definitely use this guy. Uh, it looks like you're very trained now, very skilled in that. Well, I've practiced with the spatula for quite some time now, building this house. <laughs> so shiny. It's good! This took you, what, three hours? Yeah, this bit? Well, it is much more complicated than the, than the other one, uh, with brush, but it's really looking cool. And I started to get the, the grip now, like now I... No, in the beginning it was the mark. It's cool! Wow, look at these textures. Okay, so finally, this is the result of the stucco on the kitchen wall. See, it's beautiful. It gives a really, really nice look. Yes. I really like it. Yeah, it's really it's nice. I absolutely love it. And we're gonna put over a varnish. Since this is in the kitchen and we might get water and stuff, uh, we have to cover it. We <laughs> This is not done because here we are going to put tiles and we still don't know what tiles to use, which color but we wanted to check first how the color would turn out on the wall before we decide which color on the tiles and what we have are, um, we have white tiles and we have super light grey tiles Actually, Do you want to show them? Check it. Yeah So these are from uh, Naiz, a Spanish brand, very nice and we ordered these um, test tiles, or how do you say, examples? Samples. Uh, some very long time ago. And we have the matte white, light grey and uh, semi-glossy white. And they're really beautiful because if you see they're not completely straight, they're a bit... They have a little bit of, uh, you know, up and down. And they're a bit uneven. Character. Yeah, they have a bit of character. Uh, exactly. But now the question is, which color are we gonna use? So, look here. We're gonna have a wooden board here where we're gonna have plates and glasses. Um, still don't know exactly the, the color of the wooden board, like if it's gonna be light or dark or anything, but we'll see. Probably something quite dark. So we have this one under the oh, wooden it's actually, board. Uh, very, very close to that color, which is amazing. It is pretty cool, right? It is very cool. Or do we go with the glossy white? Glossy white. Or might get too clinical on Matt. I think Matt, Matt. Matt is already out of the game. I think Matt is out also. We were not in love with the Matt. So the question is, which one of these? Well, I love uh, the grey. But will it be color. too grey? That's the thing. Because now you don't see it so much. But maybe when we have a lot of them together, it will be super grey. As a very dark. Um, that is the question. I don't know. That is the question. Focus! <laughs> okay. 